man, ghost hunting. I started ghost hunting when I was 15, like breaking into like old school asylums. And then I joined a team out in Miami and uh, that brought me all over the world investigating eventually. Yeah, I've been doing it for a long time. I've been to a lot of places. I think one of the spookiest places I've ever been to had to have been like Fenestrelli Fortress. Um, which was uh, in, in Italy. It's the second largest wall ever built uh, outside of the Wall of China. Man, I've seen some scary things, but uh, I'd have to say I've s the scariest thing I've ever seen was like shape-shifting creatures that can turn into human beings and eventually disappear into thin air. <laughs> um, I believe everybody has the ability to feel energy. I think that I use that insight uh, to help guide me on where I put my equipment to see things that I can't, you know, see. But I definitely believe I could feel energy. I think Beatrix can too. I could feel her energy. She's pretty strong. You know, I think B did a pretty good job ghost hunting tonight. Um, she seems to have like a real knack for communicating. Um, so I was really impressed with her skills. I think she did a great job. I have to say Zola was getting a knack for it. I, I'm not too sure about Beatrix's boyfriend. He's, I don't think he's cut out for this kind of work. Um, what do you know about that James guy though? He's kind of cute. There's something about that guy.